Okay, dear friends, welcome back. Today, I'd like to go on our series of one hop. The virtual machine would be Jig Chart One. I will put the link into the description section below so you can download the image. Before we start our today's video, if you don't mind, please subscribe to my channel. I do appreciate your help and support. Now let's get started. To save time, I have already imported the virtual machine into the virtual box, and now I'd like to,、uh, together with you, walk into the world of a virtual machine, which is Kali Linux. And、uh, I have already done the a map scanning,、uh, as you can see from here.、Uh, this is the command for my scanning. I did the scene scan, the virtual scan, script scan. I also did the comprehensive scan by the option of dash p dash. And from the map scanning result, as you can see over here, there are three open ports. The first one is twenty one, which runs FTP service, and also the version information for FTP. Of course, as we know, this version. Doesn't have any vulnerability we can exploit, but this does allow us to anonymous logging. Later we can check on this, and the second open port is twenty two, which runs SSH. Again, this version of SSH doesn't have any vulnerability, and the last one is eighty, and、uh, runs the HTTP service. Of course. Now, what we are going to do is to do some very basic emulation for for the port twenty one and eighty. And now,、uh, let's do the first port, which is twenty one. And let's log in to the target, and we specify the username as anonymous, and leave the password field as blank. And now we can list the content, and there is only one file which is chat info. Excuse me, and we can download this file onto our Kali Linux. And now we can quit, and we can cut or display the content of this file. As you can see, ah,、uh, maybe although. There's some gibberish、uh, characters, but uh, uh, apparently the author told us the username is chat, and the password、uh, password please go to this image. Of course, we can copy the file name, and then we can paste in our browser address bar. Yeah. Why? Yes. This is my favorite place to relax. How could I you tell? How could you tell? Of course, I never been here before, so I use the search engine, the image search engine, to、uh, make some research on this image, and I use the Yandex image search engine, and we can upload our image. Of course, first we need to download. Let let's go back to our browser. We need to save an image to our working directory, and now we can use this search engine and upload the image onto the website. Yeah. Uh, the search engine of Yandex has retrieved some、uh, results. I think this should be the place should be the the maiden tower, right? Of course, if you have been here before, you will not need uh, uh, to do like me. And、uh, now we can log in to the target by SSH. And the password is Maiden. S Tower. Yeah, 
maiden tower. Okay, now we have already successfully logging as user chat to the target, and we can list the content of this home directory of chat. And we can cat the user. So we got the user flag. And also we can check if we can run some commands with loot privilege by running sudo. And, uh, but uh, sudo command not found. So we need to find other way to walk around and elevate our privilege. Of course, normally I will do is to use the command find to find the sorry I need to specify the type should be file not directory and uh, redirect oh sorry redirect to redir redirect excuse me redirect any error to the black hole so this command will retrieve all commands with SUID bit. And then if we can find such command, then we can elevate our privilege by using this one. Yeah, here, as you can see, there is, an, there is one interesting or suspicious command we can confirm by list the privilege of this file. We can copy the whole path and paste in here. As you can see, uh, this file, this command has SUID bit, but we need to do more research on this command. We can open up another uh, new tab and uh, use search sprite because this command, we do not have much knowledge on this, right? And we can as nail. So this, uh, this command on this two has local privilege escalation and this is the the exploit code or script we can use search sprite search sprite eh, sorry and uh, by the option of dash m and copy the whole pass or sorry not the whole pass this is the relative pass now this script will be copied into our working directory. You can list the content of our working directory. And as you can see, the script is a shell script. And uh, a bit long, of course, at this point, we will not go through the each line of the code. But obviously, we need to upload this shell script to our, our target. And this will be very easy. We can set up the HTTP server. And we can go back to our shell and go to go into the temporary directory and use the wget to download from the point of the target. Yeah, this is download, but from the from from view of Kalinux. This is upload. Anyway, you, I think you get my idea. And we can specify the IP address of the Kali Linux and also the port number. And uh, of course, I didn't remember the exact, exact full name of our script. I can copy the file name and uh, paste in here. Okay, Su successfully download, download it onto the target. And then now we can, we need to add the executable privilege to this script, this shell script. And then we can run this script. We can run this script to try to elevate our privilege. So as you can see, uh, race. So this uh, script should be shall be based on the race condition, but it failed, so not vulnerable, and uh, we'll try to uh, uh, try to 
make the race or compete with some、uh, process. So, but、uh, it failed. So maybe we need to put the script into the while loop, and then to see whether we can、uh, achieve our objective. How to do? We can while to do, and、uh, we can done. Okay, so this uh, the script first run the first time and then second time it if it failed, and it will go on, um, go on looping uh the our shell script, and finally we can get the pro the loot privilege. As you can, this is. I think this should be the fifth loop. Yeah, now we successfully、uh, upgraded our shell to the loot user, and we can go to the loot directory, and we can cut the content of the flag. So we successfully completed this virtual machine. I、uh, I hope this video can bring some value. Maybe a bit、uh, to some extent, and if you don't mind, I'd like to、uh, mention again. If you don't mind, please subscribe to my channel, and、uh, if you like it, please leave like below. Thank you. See you in the see you in the next one.